again to AA Home Gardening. Just another update on my black beans that I'm growing. So you can see there are different stages, guys. The storm came and blow down some of the corn and the peas that were right here. You can see a corn that's totally damaged there. Guys, let's show you my black bean. Yes, my black beans are growing, guys. I'm just leaving most of them to dry. You can see them there. Loads of black beans. But I have some over here that I can show you a sample of what they're looking like. Like this one is turned and everything. I could show you that one. Guys, it's still in bloom everywhere. No, we're almost. Today is the 26th of August. So we're way into summer and it's still producing, guys. It's still producing. But I have some over here that I want to show you these I have some dry ones over here I'm gonna see if I can show you what inside look like guys this is the first time growing my black black peas and you can see some dry ones right here oops today I just break that so you can see some dry one right here so let me take off one and show you so yes guys so you can see different stages there beans and corn and pumpkin and everything so there's my peas my black beans guys can you see look at that so you're on the journey with me when i saw these now i have my black beans guys but look there nice black beans guys if you haven't tried these black beans please go and try these black beans they're very very how would they call it? It's very nourishing, but they have like a meaty. It's just magnificent, guys. Really, really nice. One of my subscribers say make beautiful salad. So I'm gonna take some of the green one, you know, the mature one that's not totally dry, and then I'm gonna steam it and add it, uh, add it to my salad. So yes, guys, this was just a quick update on my black beans that I'm growing for the first first time this year. So they are scattered all over because I plant them with the corn, guys. So they would add um, nitrogen to know what corns are heavy feeders. So I have the black beans and the runner bean to help my corn patch right here. That was blown over by, is it some li li Lillian it was called? Yeah, it says my corn is like blown over, guys. I'm just leaving it and see what make it in the end because i was trying to balance back up some but you can see i will get some so you can see some corn there and my peas everywhere so time to harvest all my black bean guys so i need to come and harvest it because i don't want the rain to start coming and then i'm running my peas so i'm gonna come through look at that guys nice so i'm gonna come through harvest all these beans and then i'm gonna show you the end product now i have to remember exactly where all of them are because i have the i have the corn still some of them totally dry now guys up there these are gonna stay till next um next year these super dry one but guys i think i'm gonna incorporate something with black beans today for din din so I'm going to go through, I'm going to harvest all of these, and then I'll show you the end product. Let's show out the first few with you guys, so you can see what my black beans look like. Look at that blackness, wow. I said black is beauty. Isn't that beautiful? These are nice, fresh beans, straight from the garden. So I'm going to separate the super dry one, guys. So the ones I'm looking after, they are all cooked at the same time. So I'm not going to mix them up. Guys, look at that. My first, first year growing black beans. Guys, isn't that wonderful? God is so good. How oh, can you have a little bean coming so black, getting the same sunshine, everything like the other beans, and they're just black and pretty. So I'm going to go through. I'm going to shell the rest, and then I'm going to show you the end product. Super super pretty guys, super super pretty, and most of them have been 
roughly six to five so it's a good harvest guys it's a good harvest I saw when I was sowing them transplanting them and now harvest time so I pause shell them out and then I show you the end product here's my super dry black beans guys super dry you can hear them dry so these are gonna take much longer to cook so I separate them and these are the fresher you can see some of them have a hint of purple so that's the black bean there these are the softer one that's like turn you know just in between super dry and green so I have one of those and I have these and this is most of it I just have a few more to go and shell out guys so yes so you have seen me starting my black bean from start to finish so guys it's dinner time still not totally decided what I'm gonna do with them yet for dinner but they will be for dinner today so until next time guys keep gardening and guys remember to grow what you eat you know I tried the black beans and I loved it so I have to incorporate it in my garden this was the first year going forward they will always be in my garden so those are my beautiful 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 black beans so until next time guys keep gardening take care now bye bye like share subscribe and click the notification bell